season one starts tomorrow so here's everything that you need to know week one of the season one of the war within so first up we are going to have normal raid difficulty and heroic lfr is going to be unlocked for only wing one dungeons are you are going to be able to complete a up to a mythic zero no mythic plus yet that is going to be coming september 17th as far as delves you're going to be able to complete higher than level four and they're also coming out with a new seasonal delve as well for pvp we got a new arena and battleground season rated battleground solo queue which i'm super excited about i i mean i can't wait to just hop in there and not have to pug a group or anything like that and earn some conquests i don't know about you guys but i am so let's go ahead and talk about lfr and what the minimum item level is going to be so the minimum item level that you need to be in order to do the lfr is going to be 567 so if you aren't there and that's something that you're going to want to do season one you definitely going to want to get there there's a lot of easy ways that you guys can get there you guys can do dungeons heroic dungeons you guys can uh, kill rare monsters around uh, the open world in the war within. And you guys are now going to be able to complete the delves up to level eight. So then you guys will be able to unlock higher gear and get loot drops. That'll be able to increase your item level. The first week, you're going to be able to complete uh, Raid Finder Wing 1. And you're going to be able to hopefully defeat the Skittering Battlements, Oldrax the Devourer, the Blood Horror, Sikran, the Captain of the Sirakai, on normal and heroic difficulty so now let's talk about what item level you guys are going to be able to achieve on raid finder difficulty normal and heroic so on the raid finder difficulty the highest item level that you guys are going to be able to get it get to is 593 on normal difficulty you're going to be able to get up to 606 item level with normal drops being six around 600 on heroic this one has a pretty big boost you're going to be able to get up to 619 on your guys's gear so with mythic zero the highest item level you're going to be able to get to is 593 now you guys can take this however you guys want but you guys can get this gear and then gear yourself get ready for heroic difficulty on the raid this will probably be the easiest way where you'll be able to just do the mythics complete them get the gear and then hop into that heroic grade if that's what you guys are looking forward to doing so as far as the pvp armor goes i don't really have any information if you guys have information please put it in the comments down below so that you can help us all out um i'm not too sure what the highest item level you're going to be able to get to in pvp gear um there is going to be a way that you guys are going to be able to get um like kind of like a fill armor uh, by completing this and you'll be able to craft a higher item level pvp gear that you're going to just use as a filler until the conquest cap increases to where you're going to be able to get a full set of conquest gear as far as your delves are concerned you're if you don't have a bountiful coffer key uh loot is going to be capped at 554 now if you do have that key um depending on what tier level you go here are going to be your rewards so level one is going to be 561 2, 564, 3, 571, and onward up to tier 8, which is going to drop you a 603 item level. So this is also going to be another way to, yet again, increase your item level, get you into that heroic tier of armor so that you guys are going to be able to get into those raids, hopefully. So that's going to be it for week 1 on Season 1 of The War Within. I appreciate you guys for watching the whole video. Um, if you guys have any questions or anything like that, feel free to put them down in the comments below. Or if there's some content that you guys want me to make a video on so you guys can stay a little bit more informed, you guys let me know down in the comments below. I appreciate every single one of you guys, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Later.